Uh, this is April 19th, 2013, and the plants are really doing well. In fact, my husband said that he thinks that maybe some of this lettuce, since it's looking so good, we might go ahead and plant some of it outside. There is some cucumber and different lettuces and pepper, and um, I think that might be the ruby lettuce. I'm not really sure. <laughs> so anyhow, over here is uh, Sparky's Barley Green that I need to be getting planted in her pen. And um, there's two different um, types of beans. There's the yellow wax bean and um, there's the pole beans. And um, we have them connected to string and there's uh, like the spool um, on each one of them and you just tighten the spool and it's connected to clothesline uh, up in the um, ceiling and it's uh, running through eye hooks and it's kind of a neat way to vertically grow uh, some vegetables and kind of space saving technique and over here is lettuce planted, and then on up there is um, some cucumber. And the strawberry, we thought we would try some strawberry plants uh, inside. We had extra because they keep reproducing. And we have about three or four different types of um, strawberry plants. And they're, <coughs> excuse me, they're doing remarkably well. And um, so my husband is working on um, the pump and putting pipe in. And this is a shallow well, one horsepower pump. And um, it pumps out of a 1,550 gallon water storage tank. And he's got two other tanks that they're 1,500 uh, um, gallon tanks that he's going to um, set them up to be used uh, this way. So, you know, where, where they can be pumped and used for watering inside or outside. So he's going to be bearing all of this. Um, it's a one inch pipe. And he's got the valve shut off. And he also has a freeze proof faucet with a 10 inch barrel and when you turn it off it turns off inside and uh, so that way it doesn't freeze and he's got um, all along here he's got the pipe and uh, so all this can be watered inside or out and he has a hose bib on both of both of them both ends of the greenhouse for watering um, because we'll have We've got our berry bushes all across there. And then on up from that, we have um, onions planted, uh, sweet and green onions. And um, I doubt that you can see from filming, in, filming inside, but we also have potatoes uh, covered with straw over at that end. So there's a good bit of watering to do. And we have these wonderful uh, different types of raspberries. And one is like a yellow color, you know, it's so sweet, it's like eating candy. So we have a lot of them coming up. I'll see if I can bring it in a little closer. We have a lot of them coming up now. We have a lot of new plants. And my husband puts straw around it. And I think straw or the hardwood mulch is just an excellent choice around berries. Um, berry bushes or like strawberries and the reason that I'm saying that is there was an unbelievable amount of um, worms uh, my husband just had a path here um, for walking and he had this hardwood mulch down and uh, and also um, and, and anyhow under that was just a tremendous amount of worms when I was digging up in the pathway because uh, the, the berry bushes, even though all this was walked on, 
the, the uh, strawberries was not the berry bushes, but the strawberries was coming up in this mulch. The these are the berries that we dug up, and uh, they've got blooms on them, and they're really, really doing good. And we've got them in rows now. I don't suggest ever having um, berries any other way because they're so hard to get to. They're hard to work with if they're not in rows. I just think that being in rows is a, a better way to go. So we have uh, the different strawberries. Um, we, we don't have early glow on this side of the road. We have early glow on the other side of the road. And we have a tribute as an Ozark beauty. And um, here's where all of these wonderful berry bushes are coming up. And uh, so we keep watering all around the area uh, that the bushes are, you know, to encourage more of them to grow because that's one of the most expensive things to have to buy at the market. And you can see here, there's just a lot of berry bushes coming up from these, um, from these uh, raspberries. So, um, and on the other side is the blueberry bushes and then the black raspberries. 